Ah, oh, shit, it's just you and me now. Oh my god, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? I mean, oh, I'm live god, on stream, so I can't about? talk about that, you know? This is fucked up. You're live on stream? I am. Ah, oh, that's awesome. How many, uh, can I ask this? How many, like, viewers, subscribers, what, what does that look like? Uh, so, subscribers, um, I think we're at, like, so, Twitch is different than YouTube. Subscribers are members, and followers are subscribers. If that makes sense. All right, you already confused me. But, okay. Uh, um, <laughs> no, I, cool. I'm almost at 5K followers. I have oh, shit, almost good. 400 subscriptions. Right now, we've got nice. 30 viewers. Yeah, that's awesome. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, who who anyway, do you follow on? Who, oh, no, sorry, I had a question. I'm so sorry. No, <laughs> no there's a I was bit of a say, delay. Let's talk about us. But but what was your question? Okay, that's fine. We'll talk about us. What, what do you want to know? Um, I want to know. Um, what what are you like off camera? Like what 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 do you like when you're not doing your work? When you're having your alone time? Okay. Uh, so yeah, outside of work, I, I'm usually pretty social. Like I'm somewhat outgoing right so for me when i'm not working doing all that shit, i'm usually out with friends so for example like this this weekend was like thanksgiving right so i had a couple of american friends here in sydney we did like thanksgiving dinner we went out partied techno clubs Hell so i yeah. like to i like to enjoy a laugh you like techno don't say that i do i do, you do? Oof, yeah. okay this is perfect all right i like this uh so what do you get up to what's uh What's your um, life outside of Twitch, Malik? I, I'm super extroverted, so I'm always have to be surrounding myself with people, whether it's online or like at a bar or at a party. I just I love surrounding myself with people, meeting new people, hearing different people's perspectives on the world. Um, but when I'm not around people, I love working out, uh, working on my digital art, hiking and spending time with my family. Family is like the most important thing in my life. Awesome. You said digital art. What, is, what does do. that look like? Uh, what does it look like? Um, it depends on the day. Sometimes it may be an Among Us character with a big dick. Other days it may be like a pretty I girl. Love it. I love it. Let's go. I Do you have like know. an Instagram with your art? I, I don't. I don't. I don't oh. know why, but I don't post my art online. Okay. So there's no way of me seeing your art or the viewers seeing if your If you want to see the Among Cock, I can DM <coughs> with you afterwards. All right. That'll be sick. That'll be yeah, good. You can, so you what's, can, your, like, what's your, what's your, uh, Insta handle or something. <laughs> yeah, sure. Sure. I'll write it out. I'll write it in the chat, but what's, um, so what's your type then in a guy? What do you usually look for? Okay. Um, I usually just look for someone who has like similar morals and values with me because, um, honestly, any two people, um, if they have the same hobbies, same interests, whatever, any two people can date and get into a relationship, but it doesn't mean they can like have a life together. You know, I made mm -hmm. that mistake in my last relationship. Like we were so much alike as far as sense of humor, hobbies, you know, just fucking around and joking. But when it came to like what we want in our future and our morals and values, it was so different that it, it eventually tore us apart. So, um, I just look for people who value family who um, have a lot of self-respect and self-love. Um, I think you can't really love and respect someone else unless you can love and respect yourself a lot. And, you know, someone who just wants to spread good in the world because um, there's too much hate, you know? Like, if you check all those boxes, you're good. It, it Bonus points if you're, like, Italian or Middle Eastern because, you know, I'm a narcissist and, like, you know, I like I like myself and other people. Um, but, but if you can check those boxes, like, you're compatible with me type shit. That's a very impressive answer. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, I mean, no, honestly, that's, that's most girls when you like ask, like, no, oh, I appreciate Because honestly, Matt, like most times when you ask a girl, like, what type of guys you into, you get a range of answers, Expect but most of them are like, with a big tall and dick. funny. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the, the big dick is important. All right. So let's no, not mock not. that. But look, <laughs> if you have a chode, I'm here for you, King. Uh, you, you, you work it. I like it. Your, uh, your viewers Just are going to love you right now. Just make that thing work. And if you don't know how to, I'll teach you. No, that's true. Oh, you'll teach. See, I'll I didn't teach. take you for a teacher. I thought you'd wanted like a man that knew what the fuck he was doing, I used to be honest. To, um, I used to have a nickname in college. Um, Tell me. It, it was teacher. Um, I'm just going to say Malik instead of my first name. It was teacher yeah, Malik. Of course. Okay. And um, it was because I was very good at explaining things to other people, whether it was a new game or, or like... Um, a class in college but um i i asked people to stop calling me it because it, it just gave the wrong vibes you know like 
All right, but you also were good at teaching sex. Is <laughs> that what you're trying to say? I'm very good at teaching. I'm very good at teaching. Okay. That, that's right, what I'm that's, saying. All right, maybe we need to hire you then. This is uh, this might work out. Have you ever may, thought of doing may. sex coaching? Yeah. This, um, I have <laughs> you come not. Come join the team. Um, no, I, I haven't thought of getting into that industry, but I mean, hmm. you never know where life takes you. That's true. Yeah, I'm surprised. I would have thought, honestly, like because you come across as very, you're very confident right? Let's be honest. You're very confident. You're very sure of yourself. You're very outgoing. Like, I feel like you do have those high standards, but you kind of mentioned it all around like values and things like that. I, I oh, yeah. would have thought you would have had, maybe I'm wrong, right? But I, I can't see you with a very like shy and nervous guy that you have to Fuck teach no. or lead. Yeah, Fuck exactly. No. Like, like you I feel like you need a stronger, yeah, exactly. You need someone like outgoing, strong, like, confident. If I want to go out, I don't want to pick you up on my back and like drag you to the bar. I want to no. be like chasing you. Yeah, exactly. You're like, come with me, sit down. This is what we're doing. We're going to have an amazing time. Yeah. You don't want a guy like, that's hop like, hey, the car, so. We're driving to Florida now. Exactly. No question. Yeah, we're going. Don't yeah. pack, we'll buy clothes at Walmart. <laughs> yeah, fuck yeah. <laughs> Walmart. I know about Walmart, but I like it. <laughs> no, well, not Walmart. It's Target, but there you go. Yeah, okay. All right. You have a target in America. I didn't know that. I thought it was an Australian thing. We must have stole it from you. Oh, but no, yeah, that, like that's a uh, red logo. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I don't know. I thought that was Australian. I've never seen it in, in America. But that's <laughs> awesome. That's cool. Oh, I, yeah. Uh, yeah, you got uh, you got some high standards there. I like that. Appreciate of it. Of course, of course. I have high standards for myself. I'm disappointing myself every day, no. and I'm a great person. So. <laughs> so my standards right. are pretty damn high. All right. So I've got a very deep and uh important question for you okay. um okay i, I know everybody. everyone's watching okay um okay malik how old are you i'm 22 i'm almost 23. shit you're young you i'm very young that's good i'm you're very confident for a 22 year old that's kind of oh. like, i like it <laughs> thank you how, how old are yeah. you if you don't mind me asking okay oh you can i guess. know you're older you, than me i'll give you of um course, of course. <laughs> one guess Ah, uh, fuck. I'm going to say 32. What the fuck? Okay, that's impressive. Are you? Are you, are you stalking me? Did no, like, I'm, I'm very good What's at guessing on people's here? age. <laughs> that's very good. That's very, yeah, exactly 32. Okay, 10 years, yeah, I mean, let's yeah, call it nine number, years. Okay. I'm going to be 23 in two days. So I prefer the 10 year gap. It's kind of around, I'm like a decade older than you. It's it kind of got a ring to it. I like that. Like the older I get, the less I care about age gaps. Yeah, I mean, look, as I was saying, oh, okay. All right, Sorry, Alex, uh, time, time just flies. Uh, time all right, Malik, fly. so mm -hmm. how did you enjoy your one-on-one -on -one experience with uh, Marcus? Uh, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. 